Alright, many of you probably take people for literal with things that actually happen and the stories in the Bible that they say actually exist. Now, you see, my thing is things never actually exist. The Bible is based on astrology, okay? The stories that's in the Bible and the white image of Jesus Christ, this person we call Jesus Christ, is basically of a person named Caesar Bonjean, second son of Pope Alexander. Okay? Look it up. Do the research. Know the truth. Okay? But then, in Revelations, chapter 1, they turn around and they say, Jesus here of wool, of bronze. Okay? But they showed it white image of Christ. y'all don't seem to question that with the flow. And then y'all believe the white man or the white people these white people no they're not. What white people are are deceivers. Now the real true gods and goddesses of this earth are black people. Why? Look at the things that we've been through. We've been through hell and back. The white man lynched us, right? They killed us, they shot us, they shoot us. They have cops after us. And these same cops are people that's affiliated with a group called the KKK. What is the KKK? The Ku Klux Klan. The Ku Klux Klan, okay, are against the black race. They believe in white supremacy. All right. Now, in the Bible, they talk about the devil. What does the devil do? The devil does evil. Should we be, ta should be taken as literal? Or should we be taken as factual? Not even factual. Fictional. Okay. The devil does exist. The devil is around. The devil can appear good, but the devil is also evil. Okay? Just like the white people. The white people appear good, but they're really evil people. They only have their own best interests at heart. They have nobody else's interests at heart. They only care about their own. Ask yourself why this judicial system is against black people. Okay? Now, furthermore, this crayon system, such as race, okay, where they call us black, the white people white, white. Go look at a piece of paper, a white sheet of paper, okay? That's white, okay? Go look at that, okay? We got caught up into this bullshit called race. Look, I'm not perfect, but I'm on the quest for truth and knowledge and wisdom and understanding and truth, okay? Many of y'all fall for lies. It's time we wake up. When you go to church, ministers are asking for money, for your blessings. Should we be playing for blessings? No. You should know already that you are blessed on a daily basis. We are strong black people. We have knowledge, we have wisdom, we have understanding. We can survive without money. White people, can they survive without money? No. They'll die without money. Because everything they have to purchase, just like us, what we can go without, okay? Majority of us get caught up into the illusion. The illusion, what is the illusion? The illusion is the $800 sneakers, the $300 sneakers, the $500 belts, the 
thousand dollar suits, two thousand dollars. We want to be just like the white man, and you don't even realize it. A couple of our people who are celebrities, such as Lil Kim, they go, they bleach their skin to make it a lighter complexion, get breast implants and all this nonsense. And even our black sisters, they want to go and implant, go and get butt implants because they want to follow the white woman. Why? Because of the black brothers. They want to go for the white woman because the white woman has these fake asses, okay? Now, another subject that I'm going to touch upon is one where it might affect everyone, okay? Majority of y'all people who turn around and say y'all straight, y'all know y'all faggots on the low, okay? Because, you see, what society has done to you, they demasculinize you, okay? They demasculinize you. And they say, okay, it is okay for a black man to act like a female, which it is not. And this is what European whites do. So they want to put in our minds that we are not, we are females for mankind. But it's the other way around. It's the other way around. White people are mankind. Blacks are 100% human. Because we have something called carbon-12 that's inside of us, okay? What is carbon-12? That's the six protons, six electrons, and six neutrons. What is carbon-12? Carbon-12, six protons, six electrons, and six neutrons, okay? That's six, six, six which is so called the mark of the beast okay which we've been lied to okay the mark of the beast is not really the devil it's talking about black people okay now look it up the king james version of the bible they show you all these white fictional characters king solomon was a black man oh yes i'm gonna tell y'all the truth king solomon was a black man he wasn't a white man, he was a black man. Jesus Christ was a black man. Joseph was a black man. Now, this person, or this being we call Jesus Christ, is not even the right terminology. That's what Europeans threw upon us through the Vatican. Okay? Through the Vatican. Believe it or not, you're being fooled on a daily basis. You want to believe the lies? Continue believing the lies and be a slave to the white man. Wake up, black man, wake up. It's time for us to find ourselves. Find yourself. Find out who you are. Find out the truth about yourself. Find out where religion came from. And religion came from Egypt, okay? And they say the people in Egypt are evil people. No, that's a lie. Because why do we use the same religion that the people in Egypt, which was spirituality that the people in Egypt has taught, okay? So you people who believe in religion and think religion is here to save you and Jesus Christ is going to save you and Jesus Christ is coming again, reality, Jesus Christ is not coming again, okay? I've been hearing Jesus Christ is coming in 2000, from since I was a young. 2000 has came, 2000 has left, okay? Everything is based on belief. What you believe, you make your reality. They say the apocalypse is coming right now, okay? What is the apocalypse, okay? Let me explain something to you. Nothing can happen to this world. It's what happens to the people. White people reign of power is diminishing, okay? Believe it or not. 
You want to turn around, you want to think, okay, yeah, black men don't know what they're doing. Black men are evil people. Black men are thugs, robbers, stealers, and all this nonsense, and whatever. Hey, go ahead and believe it. But the white man has committed more evil on this earth than the black man. Wake up, people. Wake up. It's time now. We start getting our knowledge together and our wisdom together. I'm not going to say that we are 100% pure people. Yes, we do make mistakes. However, once you realize your mistakes and you know that you made a mistake, you can turn around and say, yes, I've made a mistake. I want to find out the truth. I want to change myself. So change. Don't stop. Search for truth. Have quests. Okay? That's all I got to say to y'all people. Look for truth. Stop believing the lies. The lies is not going to support you. The lies are not going to feed you. The lies is not going to take care of you. What ends up happening is you take care of yourself. Okay? Believe in yourself. Know who God is. When you wake up every morning, know who God is. Have a direct connection with God. You don't need Jesus Christ to turn around and say, okay, you are going to be saved. We don't need Jesus Christ to say you're going to be saved. We have a direct connection with God already. Find yourself, black man. Find yourself. Peace.